uh, rain showers still showing up around the city right now, but they are slowly drifting east, moving out of Dundalk, moving out of Anne Arundel County and moving towards the eastern shore. A couple more showers uh, still passing through Hagerstown in northern Frederick County, so these may skirt the northern suburbs over the next hour, but for the most part, things are really starting to dry out. A lot of this will be pushing east of us where you can see more of the showers that are coming out of Virginia. They're aiming more towards southern Maryland and the lower eastern shore. This is all with a cold front passing by. Eventually, it will feel a lot colder behind that front this afternoon. So Futurecast hints at maybe another shower popping up before 8 o'clock, though a lot of it is drifting east even by 9 and even uh, by about 10. All that rain is leaving Salisbury and Ocean City. So we'll dry out this afternoon. The skies will eventually clear for more sun until you get into western Maryland with cold gusty winds building in. Snow showers likely to develop this afternoon, last into the night, really last for the next couple of days out there. Great for the ski resorts. Even the colder pattern next week should allow them to uh, get some new, more fresh snow. Our temperatures though around Baltimore starting out in the mid 40s will be briefly topping out in the 50s this afternoon. If you want to get out in the warmest part of the day, try to do it at about a noon or 2 p.m. After that, with the winds picking up so much, it's going to feel a lot colder. So by 3 p.m. we're already falling through the 50s after sunset will be down through the 40s. Tonight we drop into the 30s, 38 in the city, 33 for Timonium and Rock Hall, 37 degrees, and it's still breezy tonight, which does add a wind chill. Wind chill is a big factor for the next couple of days. Highs in the 40s tomorrow feeling like the 30s by Saturday. Saturday. Parts of the day could feel like they're in the 20s because of the winds. At least the weekend is dry. You'll have great travel weather. Sunday looks dry as well. It's into early next week with a much colder pattern. The highs in the 30s, the lows in the 20s. We may see multiple snow showers Monday, Tuesday, maybe even Wednesday. Now